So today we've got the IntelliFlow and we are gonna dive into some programming. As you can see, the IntelliFlow has this nice little weather resistant door so the screen can stay protected. We always recommend when you're done uh, programming these or turning things on or pretty much touching this keypad in general, close your door, save the life, because these things are mighty expensive. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna open up our cover and we're just gonna go ahead and dive into the programming. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is set the date and time on these things. So the, the cool part with the date and time um, with these IntelliFlows now is that they have an extremely long battery backup and what it is, is strictly for the date and time. So say you lose power for two days, three days, seven days, the time will actually stay. So if you see up here in the top right corner, it says 12.02 a.m. Uh, so we just turned this thing on two minutes ago and this is factory settings. So what we wanna do is change that to where it's gonna save the time to where if you do get a power outage and power does turn back on, say it turns back on at 6.15 a.m. So at 6.15 a.m. it's gonna read whatever schedules we have in there and it's gonna power into whatever schedule you have. So first things first, what you're gonna to wanna to do is press menu and then you're gonna to wanna to go to settings. So you're gonna press the select button in the middle and see how the first option is date and time. You're gonna press select. So what you're going to do is see how it says 0101 of 2010. I'm going to press select to get into that menu again. So right now what I'm going to do is change it to January 3rd of 2020. And then see how it says save. So if, in, in telephones are very infamous of the select and save button getting confused. So watch what happens if I press select again. Key error. So it wants me to press that save button. So I'm going to press save. So now my date is in there. So now what I wanna do is press the up button. As you can see, date and time, it has the options at the very, very top to go to a different menu. So I wanna press up. So this is what it, I can do AM, PM, which I can change my hour format. So if you're a military man or a woman, you can go to 24 hour date and time. But we're gonna stick it to AM, PM. And again, save button to save. I'm gonna go up again to my time. So what I wanna do is adjust this to my current time of day. So what I'm gonna do now See how if I go down, it goes to p.m. and goes up to a.m. So what I want to do is make it to 1 o'clock p.m. Right now it's 1.30 p.m. And if you see, I press arrow over, and that's how I get back and forth from every single mini menu. So now I'm going to go to 1.30 p.m. Again, I don't want to press select. I want to press save. So that is currently all three of the date and time options that I can do. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Subscribe today if you haven't subscribed. Check out the links below and we got a lot more content coming your way. Thank you.